Hey guys, I'm Sam Rixandas. Welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you that how to easily change your processor from your motherboard that may be up, uh, upgrade or replace uh, for your damage processor. So uh, stick around with me and in this video, I will update my Core 2 Duo uh, 6600 processor with the uh, newly purchased uh, 8600 3.33 GHz processor. So previous was 2.40. Now I will update. I am upgrading to 3.33. So it is uh, it is a significant update, quite significant update in Core 2 Duo. So this tutorial is very easy. Don't take it hard. And also, if you want to purchase a 600 processor, buy link is in the description below. You can check it out, which will also help my channel and subscribe my channel. Tap the bell icon to get each notification from me on first, because I bring such tutorial video for you guys. So without wasting a time, let's start this tutorial. Okay. So uh, to start the uh, tutorial, first uh, we need to remove the cover. So the, here is my. Uh, this is a cover. You have to remove. Okay. Either by and uh, by just unscrewing the uh, screws at the back side and sliding towards outside. And it is now removed. And uh, I hope you can see there are some components, wire, lots of thing next thing and make sure your the computer is unplugged from the power supply and then next uh, take a screwdriver like the strong screwdriver and make a space and uh, cause there are lots of wire and this is the motherboard power connector this is the fan connector so you have to remove those cause this is not necessary but you can also um, keep that so I, I will try keeping that so first open up the this CPU fan cause the CPU processor under the fan and this fan cools the CPU so you need to just open up the uh, CPU fan by just unscrewing the screws okay so I have the uh, remove the CPU fan and now I have to remove the connection of CPU fan okay yeah, it all has been removed so next you can see this is the processor um, area I hope you can see and this is the latch lever you have to uh, remove the processor by just uh, opening the latch so just open it up and you can see it is now open and now take out the processor and uh, uh, before taking out make sure in which direction this yellow small yellow arrow is so keeping it mind just remove it this is my old processor. This is not damaged, but I am just upgrading. This is also Core 2 Duo 6600 2.4 GHz processor, and this is my 3.3 GHz processor. So this is a quite significant clock speed uh, update um, in the Core 2 Duo. First, take a bruise and, and just remove if any dust are there. Next step is that. Uh, to take any thermal paste maybe thermal grease or thermal paste just like this or any thermal pouch just like this this is my thermal paste and I'm gonna apply it you can spray it with your finger it is better that if you spray it all around the CPU not the outside only the uh, top surface of the processor and also add a little bit on the uh, heatsink unit of the fan now just uh, put this new CPU uh, new processor into the slot and make sure that yellow direction is that same way which it was the previous processor so mine was the this way so I am putting it down and when you are putting be careful don't force okay so place it very lightly and just close the latch keeping pressed by one hand and close the latch okay that's it and also make sure please and uh, don't keep your processor uh, at any naked surface it may damage next thing um, connect your uh, CPU fans connector to the board uh, 
I have connected the uh, CPU fans connected. Next, place the fan on the board by locating the fan screw hole. We have to be very careful during this process. Don't do any types of hurry. Next, tie the screws roundwise. If you tie this one two times, then also do this one two times, then two times and two times, respectively and clockwise anything. But don't tie any screw at a time because it will not fit your fan properly. So here it goes. Okay, so I have tightened the screws and keep tightening uh, uh, round wise until and the screws are getting tightened. Okay, and make sure if the, and there are no any loose wires. If there are any loose wires, just zip it with the zippers. Now everything is complete and make sure if there is no wires uh, opened or unplugged from the um, components. Okay, so we are now ready basically. Now I will start the system and show you everything is okay. Let's start the computer. Yeah, it started. Cool. Yeah, this is a JBX logo and my hard disk is SSD. So it takes it boots in 20 seconds. Uh, less than 20 seconds, it depends. Okay, in the CPU, we can say Intel Core 2 Duo CPU E86 3.0 GHz. You can see, and also here, I hope you can see. I'm gonna zoom it a little bit. This is my Kotoro CPU and this is the uh, 6MB L2 cache. The core speed is this. Okay, so everything is running fine. Uh, so guys, after shutting down your computer, uh, let let cover the uh, CPU lid which you have uncovered at the starting point. And that's all about and the tutorial that how to change and you think everything is okay so that was it if anything any query uh, please comment below and if you uh, want to buy please check my below link I have purchased from amazon.in or also you can purchase, buy from flipkart so okay so finally that was all about please like share and comment and subscribe my channel and tap the bell icon I hope to meet you in next video till then have a great time ahead take care bye guys